Good morning, friends. It's uh, Saturday morning, well, Saturday mid morning. We all kind of slept in. We didn't get in until uh, about 1 one twenty ish in the morning. Uh, the the Bucky's Wi Fi was a bust. It turns out they don't have it. I don't think they want you to hang around. They want you to buy a whole lot of awesome stuff and then go. So I jumped over to Starbucks and their internet is not made for uh, uploading videos to YouTube. It's just. I don't know. So when the little bar said it would take 45 minutes to upload, uh, we bailed and waited to post it until um, late last night. So anyway, we are back in Louisiana where we belong, uh, where we call home. Sarah is, everybody's kind of getting ready and starting their day. I'm drinking community coffee out of my, uh, <laughs> my uh, Mardi Gras crew mug. And everything we're gonna get our get every every last little bit of the Louisiana experience out of this thing so um, let's see what happens today and we'll, we're excited to bring you guys along I know. I feel like he needs to bring the bring the heavy. enjoyed our piano concert that Gabriel put on at uh, BB and Pawpaw's house and now we're on our way to I'm going to introduce Gabriel to someone very special to me uh, this is baby dedication weekend uh, and so there's uh, I wanted to take him to meet my grandfather who was a strong Christian man and a good example in my life and I learned a lot of positive things from him and um, I, in fact I, I don't think I ever saw him without a smile on his face so he's very important to me he passed away uh, several years ago um, before Sarah and I actually even started dating um, and I don't get now that we live in Texas. I don't get to uh, go by his gravesite very often at all anymore, and I really hate that. So it was important to me that I take Gabriel out there and sit with him for a little while and talk to him about his great grandfather, my papa. We're gonna spend some time out there, and I'm gonna let him get to know his great papa, and uh, I'm just gonna share some of my memories with him and spend some quality time some quality father-son time uh, with my papa, a man that meant a whole lot to me personally. Uh, if I'm being totally honest, that was a lot harder than I expected it to be. Um, I haven't been out here in a while, and I really feel bad about that. Uh, so often, when we come into town, we come into Alexandria to see family, we get caught up seeing our friends and everything else, and we don't make some of these things like this a priority. 
and that's something that I need to do better in the future and I think I'm gonna do better in the future um, but it, that really meant a lot to me that to spend that time out there with Gabriel um, introducing him to to my papa so and hopefully I can not only live up to the uh, example that my father has set for me but also to the example that my grandfather has said to me and being a strong godly man godly husband and uh, just a super loving father that's that's all I really want you know and I want my kids to remember that about me and my kids to remember that about me uh, just like I remember that about him and that I'm gonna remember about my dad so now I think we're gonna go do something a little bit more happy <laughs> I may take a quick detour uh, and buzz through our old college campus where Sarah and I met that kind of that always makes me feel better if I'm if I'm feeling down I like to do a quick tour of Sarah and Jacob memories and uh, that that just always makes me feel good Gabriel, your mom and I spent a lot of time in that building. She was a theater major, and I was a media communications major. Probably time to take it to the house. Alright, we're in BB's van on our way to see grandma, my grandma, Gabriel's great grandma, and we're gonna stop at the snowball stand. And get legit real snowballs. Real snowballs. None of this Texas snow cone crap. <laughs> real ones. Tell us about your snowball. I forgot to order it flat top, but look at it. It's beautiful. Can't wait to eat it. Gabriel's kicking me in the <laughs> camera sure shaking. Is. There's BB's. Grape. Grape snowball. Yum. Baby snowball. He's mad because he didn't get one. What do you get with cream? Snowball. That's mine. Come on. Come on. Grandma may be about to achieve the impossible. Come on. Gotta get that other leg out. He wants to crawl yeah. so bad. Go get it. Come on. Come on. Well, come on. Come on. There you go. Come on. You can do it, baby. Come on. Come on. Jacob, come on, game room. Come on. Mom and Jacob all weekend. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. <laughs> Well, everybody, we had a really good day. Um, it's hard to justify going out and doing, you know, like adventure type things when we come back to Louisiana because when you live so far away from family, you don't get to see them very often. So you really want to spend as much of your time in and in ho at home with your family and your friends. So we spent a lot of today just visiting and catching up with old friends, family, you know, that we don't get to see very often. So no like swamp tours and alligators and stuff like that this time around. Uh, tomorrow is baby dedication. That'll be a fun experience for us and hopefully it'll be a fun experience for you guys too. So thanks for watching. Be sure to give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. Subscribe to our channel. Be sure to click that bell so that you get alerts every time we post a new video and leave us a comment share some love with us. So hope you enjoyed today and we'll see you guys tomorrow.